I love that. Yeah, I'm gonna talk about this clip. I was waiting for someone to post it, honestly. Take, to be honest, because at first, like, I thought Kick was interesting because... And honestly, I even texted Jinxie. I, I don't agree with him, and I have to violate now because, bro, my community and I worked so hard to get Kick to where it is at today, and I can't let people, even though I f*** Jinxie chat, I can't let people downplay the hard work that you guys have gone into this and how much I've worked hard for this and I can't go for this, bro. It's, like, disrespectful to my community to let the fly. But you could tell he wasn't speaking about me, but he could have said this a lot better. You know, obviously they signed like Aiden, XQC, Bruce, Rage, like all in the span of a couple months. So I'm like, bro, like maybe it'll like go down that route. But yeah. then it just went down like IRL streaming route of like exactly just the worst thing you could imagine. Like literally. God shame, really. Because yeah. um, I feel like it's pretty obvious, but any crime, illegal activity, let's not do that. I mean, like, even like fist fights, I feel like, why are we even streaming this? I, I, yeah. I, exactly. <laughs> like, fights are cool. I get yeah. it. But like, every stream ending in a fight, like, yeah. it's no longer fun or cool or interesting. It's just kind of sad. Yeah. No, it's, dude, it's fucking, it's, it's literally the, I think Kick's best play would be to fix that and like create their own kind of culture. Cause right now they have a culture, but it's just like we it's, kind of said. It's like the worst one you can have. <laughs> Look, when people think kick, like mainstream wise, you think of Aiden Ross, bro. You think of Aiden Ross, you think of XQC. You don't think of these people that do all these crazy things. You just don't. So what I'm trying to say is this is my baby, bro. Like I can't go for this because you guys got to understand, like we came here with no app. I built the ground up and I don't fuck with these streamers doing that. that shit. But you can't put me in the same category as them, bro. The content I've done this year is insane so far and like the the plans i have is everything is great the warehouse everything right so jinxie and critical if you guys saw exactly go if you guys saw what twitch was seven years ago you would be like what the f every new platform in the beginning is not going to be a hundred percent amazing bro obviously eddie keeps those mother around because right now they are technically good publicity is good every all publicity is good publicity so bro so right now kick i, I agree eddie we don't need to have certain streamers doing certain things, but hey, that's the way it is right now, and I, and I can't do anything about it. But what I can tell you is Kick is working. Uh, what about other, all the other creators, the small creators that are actually putting in work and hours and getting paid 90 some percent of their revenue? It's working for them. Um, and, and, and the community here is amazing because there's a lot of people that just want to show love and, and stuff. And then there's also the people that chase the hype and stuff. But, you know, at the end of the day, bro, I worked really, really hard to get Kick working and shit. Without my community, without me, there's no Kick. Right, so I don't like this. It's it's a subliminal diss in a way towards me, because he it could have been cleared up. Like this is not towards Aiden, because everyone when they think kick, you think Aiden. You don't fucking. You might think like the violent streamers and shit, but you, you think me. This is my shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I, I, I didn't really fuck with this at all. I didn't I, I didn't like this at all. I, I, and again, Train was like, I want to talk about what he said too. Like that's not cool. Like you know it is what it is. But again, I have nothing but love and respect for Jinxie as a creator. You know what I'm saying, guys? Um, so. I'm not gonna say say fuck Jinxie and shit, but just it should have been cleared up. Like, hey, like Aiden Ross is, is in his own lane, obviously. That's Aiden. Like, he's doing his own thing. He has a warehouse utilizing this year. You know, he has a bunch of shit, blah, 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 blah. But your ego is insane. It's called confidence, R King. Uh, it's not ego at all. What I've done for Kick is impossible. Like, if I was not to come to Kick, this shit would have not worked. And every single person knows that. I was literally saying controversial shit. I was literally saying, doing crazy shit when it first came on. My community kept it. The craziest way possible. This shit would have not worked at all. I, Eddie even told me that. Eddie said, yo, I'm not going to lie. You would This would have been fucked. And guys, guess what? You have to have confidence your entire... you you got to have confidence. All you guys saying ego and shit, that's why you don't amount to anything, bro. You have to believe in yourself. You got to think... You got to talk your shit sometimes, bro. Because that's where... That's... It's the truth. You got to do it. You got to stay humble with the shit you do when you get the shit, but you got to be humble. But, but bro, you got to have confidence in yourself, bro. It's not ego. It's facts. And that's it. That's all I got to say, bro. I love all you guys. Thank you guys so much. The kick community is amazing. Um, and I agree with these other streamers doing crazy shit and all these scripted shits and stuff. But, hey, bro, I will say one thing. We're, sitting, we're also, I'm going to stick up for Fousey, chat. When, when content was dry for a couple months and shit, Fousey made that shit lit. You know, that Fousey run was amazing, bro. Everyone was, everyone watched that shit. It was just something that, like, you gotta, like, really, like, give your flowers to, bro. You know? Um, you made probably, you had probably over, like, 50 negative articles, headlines about you in the first month of kick. Exactly, bro. 
This shit was supposed to not work in my favor. I came with no app. I came saying controversial shit. It worked, bro. It fucking worked. And that's all because of you guys, bro. So thank you guys for making this shit work. And 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 W chat, W kick, W committee, all that. I didn't see this. X reacted to it too. I'm curious what X says. Bruce Rage. I called this man of a couple months. I'm like, bro, like maybe it'll like go down that route. But then it just went down like IRL streaming route of like just the worst thing you can imagine. Like literally. Goddamn shame, really. Um, what is this camera penny? I'm I'm not having a headache. Any crime. Is he wearing the same shirt? Activity. Dude. Let's not do that. I mean, like. Even like fist fights, I feel like why are we even streaming? So am I, chat. Jenny loves you. I, exactly. Hey, like, what's up, man? Fights are cool, I get it. But LOL, like, dark. Every stream ending in a fight, like yeah. it's no longer fun or cool or interesting. It's just kind of sad. Yeah. No, it's, dude, it's fucking, it's, it's literally the, I think Kick's best play would be to fix that shit and like create their own kind of culture. Because right now they have a culture, but it's just like we kind it's, of said. It's like the I also want to say one thing, like, if anything, chat, and if anything, Twitch is, Twitch is the downfall right now. Like, chat, like, when was the last time you guys opened a Twitch app and you don't get hit with a million ads? I tried watching a fucking a stream like two days ago, right? I got hit with I left instantly. It's not even the streamer's fault. Guys, they're forced to, like, spam ads. Like, I can't even watch it. How do you guys watch it when you watch 30 fucking commercials in, in a minute? How? You know what I mean? Like, and guys, Twitch Prime is going to go away soon. They can't afford it anymore. Exactly, Liko. Guys, at the end of the year, Twitch Prime is done. So now look. It's like, if you're a creator who knows your worth, I, I just don't get it. I don't know. First one you can have. Be honest, because at first... Wait. Okay, okay Jack, I guess I'm not... I guess I don't want to be a dick writer, but I, I got to keep it a buck. Um... Guys, the platform is what, not even, it was like barely a year old. Facts. People, people, Just hit one I year. Mean, there's like, the five thing stopped and it was like three or four creators. How are, gonna have, how are we gonna make a conclusion about the entire platform of three or four creators out of like thousands on thousands and then say, oh dude, they don't have, they have a culture of that when a site's not even a year old compared to like a, like a 15 year old overall like complete line. It's like not even comparable on either end. Like, it's not even... It's not even comparable. Uh, I'm confused. What the fuck? What? Well, guys, what would... Why would... Why... Let me a defending thing in. If it's like three or four Revol, they had like five on their streams, it's not happening anymore, right? Or, the, or, the, or the, there's one of it. Why are you making a conclusion about the entire round because of three or four guys? It's true. I don't get it. He's literally right. Makes no sense at all. It's literally true. WX Angola.